Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are all doing very well. Sorry for the inactivity with the videos. Today guys, we're going to be talking about the Game Awards. Now, the Game Awards for this year, in a nutshell, was pretty mid. I mean, there was some very questionable things. I think the biggest thing for me was personally that Resident Evil 4 Remake did not win game of the year i think that was the biggest disappointment i don't even know anything about boulders gate or if i'm even pronouncing it but i know it's been praised for a lot of good things and you know i don't have anything to talk about that because i have no knowledge of Baldur gates 3 or whatever it's called and pretty much what i'm going to be talking about is christopher judge the voice actor for kratos in the rebooted god of war series uh in the 2018 game we're going to be talking about his very questionable comments on the call of duty campaign because he roasted this year's call of duty call of duty modern warfare 3 now for boulders gate 3 and that whole controversy i think that was kind of a bad decision but i do get where people are coming from on that end i guess the game is being praised for the right things and how modern triple a games are being ruined nowadays and it was a good thing that game won but i'm not going to be talking about that like i said we're going to be talking about christopher judge's comments now christopher judge said that his speech and, and i'll throw it on screen for you guys so you guys can watch it all right all right i get it i get it i'm not gonna stand up here making long speeches. I'm gonna stick to the script. No eight minute speech like last year. But fun fact, my speech was actually longer than this year's Call of Duty campaign. But pretty much what he said was that his speech from last year was actually longer than this year's campaign. <laughs> that is sad, man. When your game is getting roasted, for possibly having the worst campaign in Call of Duty history. What, the campaign's like roughly about three hours long? Which is questionable. I don't think the campaign is that bad as people make it seem. I don't like the open combat missions. I think they're just terrible and a really bad decision for the Call of Duty campaigns going forward. I mean, maybe if they change a few things here and there, maybe it could fit differently, but I do wish the developers had more time to work on that. And unfortunately, Sledgehammer was kind of put in a pickle where they had to rush out the game and unfortunately things were ruined because of that. I mean, man that whole comment was just really really funny to me especially knowing how activision is with their biggest money making franchise out there it's quite unfortunate i mean if that doesn't really show you how much call of duty has taken a big hit in the last couple of years then i don't really know what does i mean call of duty has been suffering with a lot of big issues in the last couple of years and it's not really good man i mean a lot of players have quit the franchise since then i mean i didn't play modern warfare 2 that long i didn't play modern warfare 2019 i think the only one that i ever played was call of duty black ops cold war because i think that was a solid title and you know i do want to come back to that game and revisit it very soon i do plan on making videos probably in the next couple months covering that game because i think call of duty modern warfare 3 and call of duty black ops cold war are the best games that we've gotten in the last couple years i know that's a big controversial opinion because call of duty modern warfare 3 was never supposed to happen it was just dlc i mean if you really think about it the game is dlc now that's pretty much gonna have to wrap up today's video guys what he said was not wrong though i mean the call of duty campaign for this year was pretty terrible but i'm not gonna be the one to review it or if you guys are interested in a review for that let me know down in the comment section below or if you guys do want any opinions or talked about or anything like that uh let me know i mean i'm interested in all kinds of conversations for different games i'm gonna be making some borderlands videos here in the next couple days um we'll see where it goes but other than that guys i hope you guys definitely did enjoy and without further ado i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out